Yo, what is poppin', you guys? It's your boy, Mega Flint, y'all. And I am back here with another wrestling video, guys. As always, guys, make sure to also please go ahead and give this video a like. Subscribe to my channel, guys, haven't already. And put a comment down below. And also, guys, turn that notification on. And also, guys, make sure you also go ahead and follow my social platforms on my on my Instagram, my Snapchat, and my TikTok, and my Twitter account. So, yeah, make sure to follow all my social platforms. And also, guys, um, if you guys want to watch WWE for free, make sure you go ahead and put the link is in my the YouTube page right here. The link is in the description. As always, guys, this is my top my top five WWE Royal Rumble 2021 winners men's Royal Rumble edition. So, yep, let's go ahead and get to it. So number five, who I pick for the number five is Shinsuke Nakamura. Because, you know, and in the gauntlet match, Shinsuke Nakamura won the Royal Rumble. Ru Let's spell it out. He won the Royal Rumble at 2018. And then, uh, in the, and then, in the gauntlet match, he beat Corbin. He beat Daniel Bryan to face off Roman Reigns. But then, all of a sudden, Paul Heyman um, asked Adam Pearce that he's in the match as well. And that really caused Shinsuke Nakamura mad. So, so what I'm saying is, is I'm thinking Shinsuke Nakamura is gonna win this one because he is sick and tired of Roman Reigns. Cause him and Jey Uso cost Shinsuke Nakamura a title shot match. All thanks to Roman Reigns, Adam Pearce, and Jey Uso. Number four, I'm gonna say the Messiah, Seth. Rollins, man, nobody, nobody didn't even see the dude. He didn't even show up on every Friday Night SmackDown episodes. He he been going over here with Becky Lynch, all right. But I'm think, but I'm thinking Vince McMahon is planning to let Seth Rollins return in the 2021 Royal Rumble. So now I'm thinking, you know, the reason why he's not showing up on SmackDown is because he wants to return on the Royal Rumble. So, what I'm thinking is, though, uh, if, you know, if he can return and he wins the whole thing, it, it, there's going to be a Roman Reigns versus Seth Rollins feud. It, it's going to be a Roman Reigns versus Seth Rollins feud at WrestleMania 37. Number three, I would say the Celtic Warrior Sheamus because he really wants a WWE Championship match against Drew McIntyre. So... You know, the Celtic War has been a WWE champion for a long, long time. And, yeah, he lost to the Roman Reigns. He lost to the Randy Orton. So, yeah, I will go to say Sheamus might win this. And, you know, he's going to give people the bro kicks. Because do you guys also don't know, do you guys also remember when Sheamus won the Royal Rumble? Because he, he won that event. And, uh, and I'm thinking... Sheamus might do it again, and then he'll face Drew McIntyre or or, or Goldberg, whoever wins the, the title cha the championship at the Royal Rumble. So yeah, I'm thinking Sheamus is gonna win that. All right, here's my next one, number three. Number three, I would go ahead and say, oh, read it all. No, I, wait, I already did five, and I did four. Oh, it's number three. Number three. I would say the rated R superstar Edge. Yeah. Man, let me tell y'all something right now. Let me tell y'all something. Edge returned to the Royal Rumble, man. I was surprised and shocked when he came back to the Royal Rumble. And you know why though? Cause man, I'm just I'm just proud of Edge. And now I'm thinking. That this might be the one. I was like, bro. Uh, so uh, when I watched the Royal Rumble 2020, I was like, bro. Edge and Drew McIntyre might be the final two of the Royal Rumble match. But all of a sudden, Roman Reigns eliminated him. So. So. What I'm thinking is. Edge might win this event and face whoever. Roman Reigns or Drew McIntyre or Goldberg. Whoever. Remember. Remember, guys, before a reminder, 
that Drew McIntyre is facing Goldberg for the WWE Championship. So, we don't even know who's going to win between the, those two guys. But, yeah, I'm thinking Edge is going to win this event. Okay? Number two. The Limitless one, Keith Lee. Remember, guys, Keith Lee had his title opportunity against Drew McIntyre at the Raw Legends Night. So, yeah, so, yeah McIntyre won. He retained his title against Keith Lee. So, I don't even know what's next for Keith Lee. So, what I'm thinking is, is I'm thinking Keith Lee might win this event and face Drew McIntyre. If he could totally face Drew McIntyre, uh, and, but he has to win the Royal Rumble. He has to win the Royal Rumble. Another news, I'm thinking he might join the Hurt Business. He might join the Hurt Business. I don't even know. He might join the Hurt Business, but yeah. Now, number one. Number one. Who I think is going to be on number one? Um, hmm, hmm, I don't know who those guys put. The Fiend. Yep, I say The Fiend Bray Wyatt. Yep, number one. I say The Fiend Bray Wyatt. Bray Wyatt. Yes, Bray Wyatt. The Fiend Bray Wyatt. The Fiend, The Fiend, The Fiend. So, yeah, so Keith Lee is on number two. Number one. Is the fiend Bray Wyatt? Man, I mean for real, Bray Wyatt never returned since he got burned by Randy Orton at TLC. So I'm thinking if the Bra if the fiend Bray Wyatt might come back at the Men's World Rumble match, he might win. He might win the event. He, I'm telling y'all. The Fiend might win this this event. Ain't going to be no retribution is going to stop him. Not even, okay, yeah, you know, it's not, not even Seth Rollins if he returns to the Royal Rumble. But I'm thinking the Fiend might be the one. He might be the one. The Fiend Bray Wyatt might be the one to win this Royal Rumble. When we leave, you need to go bathe. Her mom will be at you at 230. Okay, as I was saying, though, the Fiend Bray Wyatt might win this event because all y'all have to do is just let him in. And if he win, he might face Drew McIntyre since the Fiend and Drew McIntyre are, are on Monday Night Raw and goes, goes at it at WrestleMania 37. We already know who's going to win. That's the Fiend Bray Wyatt. Well, guys, that they, that is my top five people who I'm thinking will win the Royal Rumble of the 30-man Royal Rumble match. Yep, those are my top five people who I'm thinking going to win the 30-man Royal Rumble match. So, I want to say, I want to say thank you guys for watching this video. I want, I, want, I want you guys to make sure to get this. I, want, I, want to, I just want to say thank you guys so much for 400 subscribers. It's been a huge opportunity for me, and I cannot wait to see what the future holds when I get to 500, 500 subscribers. And you know what? I'm glad. I'm glad. I'm glad I made 400 subscribers. I did this for my family. I did this to all you guys. I just want to give you guys a hug, but we can't because, you know, six feet, coronavirus. But, I also, but I'm also thinking that they might bring the fans back on WrestleMania 37. They rescheduled WrestleMania 37 to 11... It's to April 11th. So, yep. Vince, you better bring the fans back. You better bring the fans back, Vince McMahon. Well, guys, as always, though, guys, that is it for my today's YouTube video. So, make sure you go ahead and hit those videos. Likes, comment down who you got, who are your five picks to win the 2021 30 Man's Royal Rumble match. And also, guys, turn that notification on. And make sure you guys also follow me on the slow, slow, social platform the link is in my description and also and also there's another way you guys can totally go ahead and watch wrestling for free that link is also in the description as well as always guys thank you guys for watching peace